Initially, I would think about my family. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't think it, you can help it. You know, you yeah. just you think about how it's going to affect the people that you love and the people that you care about. The revelation at the end of the first episode is that you guys discover there's this uh, piece of software that shows that there's a doomsday clock for the entire world, that the sun is going to doomsday clock really like be that. awful for us, yeah. and that in five years, everyone's going to be wiped out. What's the exploration going to be going forward when you've got this huge kind of wipeout knowledge that you have to kind of reframe every day? When you have a secret, and we're bound together by this secret, mm -hmm. and we know that people are getting killed by this secret, It's you have to kind of put one foot in front of the other and go about your day-to-day -day life and the job mm -hmm. and kind of also uh, extinguishing um, events and crimes that are caused by this uh, leakage of, mm -hmm. of this information. So, you know, obviously if people are getting killed, we wouldn't, we wouldn't, like share it like with our nearest and dearest right. but the the interesting thing is we have to, I my character has to leak it to save us and Jim's character is like no 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 so we we're at odds straight right. away which is fascinating it sort of enhances you as a person you know how, how do you what what would you do and Renko's character is is much more thoughtful and mm -hmm. precise and you know thinks you know with a head my character probably works from his heart mm -hmm. a lot more so his instinct is just like, well, I, I, need to, I need to save my family. I need to look after the people that I love. Whereas Renko's thinking maybe a few steps beyond that, you know. So it, it becomes a really interesting way in which we both react to the information that we've, we've, we've discovered. You, know. you guys are the perfect embodiment of the what if. You know, the two camps of where most people are going to fall. When you play a role like this, you know, I'm sure it gets under your skin a little bit that you think, well, what would I do too? Do you feel like you were uh, in the same compass as your characters or are you opposite in how you think you would react? Yeah, I think so. I mean, it's hard when you've lived it. <laughs> and, you're like, and you also have to like be on board with what your character's doing. Right, exactly. So it's like, actually, no. I think I would. I think mm -hmm. I would be like very straight about it. You know, this is going to happen. Mm -hmm. You know, it's all going to happen to us all. So it doesn't matter whether, you know, the world's going to end or not. We still have to operate in this world until right. that happens. Yeah, I think initially I would think about my family. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I don't think it, you can help it. Yeah, you know, you yeah. just you think about how it's going to affect the people that you love and the people that you care about. Uh, I don't know if I would be as brave as my character. Mm. I'd probably, you know, panic. <laughs> so he keeps quite a sort of strong head throughout. You know, a very definite through line of what, what he needs to do. But yeah, deals start being made and, and ways of sort of maneuvering through the, the ultimate end of, in, a, in a, the most safe and comfortable mm -hmm. way possible start to happen. And, you know, that, that's interesting to me, you know, what what would really go down, Absolutely. what kind of deals would be made, would people in power have an easier ride for people who don't have any power, yeah. would do the poor get thrown into the firing line more than, do you know what I mean, there's, there's all, all these that, sort of exactly. ideas that sort of come up with sort of hierarchy structure, so it, it becomes really interesting and, and the show sort of looks at, you know, how people might turn to religion or might turn their back on religion right. and and what religion means if, if the ultimate end is, is, is coming. And, mm -hmm. you know, so there are all these really fascinating different perspectives of how people will react to it, which is, which is really exciting.